I would never think I would go to so many fun and weird and like unexpected places that that I do right now when I was a kid. It's really unique to think like this is actually like what I do for a living and this is how I get by and that's pretty pretty sick if I could say that. Ah. Young thing, living thing, fragile and quivering, iron in the blood, simmering, never giving in. They try to take your fire, but your phoenix rising up. So many shadows on the wall, but they're to frighten us. And we ain't like it. When you're a kid and go to school and you're like thinking about doing what everybody else does, you know? You're always kind of just, yeah, I'll probably go to school for those 13 years and then study and then find a job. But then you found out what you actually think is really fun you can actually become something more and something, something else. No thoughts, you just dare to feel. No power, no pause. All it wants for you to kneel. When I started traveling more, I had a lot of friends back home and everything, and you kind of have to let go of more of that. And you can go to all those birthday parties or all those like gatherings and all the social events, and that kind of is the negative thing, I guess. But I don't know, I can't put it in a negative way, really, because. You get so much out of it and you get so much experience and memories that you can't really put in a negative way, but I guess you just have to prioritize what you really want and what you want for the future. And I've always thought about how the people that are my age are now kind of studying geography and everything and learning about that stuff while I'm out there, out here experiencing it all. and kind of watching and seeing firsthand what it actually is. We pay homage by killing the things we need. I love traveling to strange places. It's fun because all of the food is kind of weird and the people are totally different and no one speaking speaks English. Some rifles. Yeah. Somebody just lost the fight. Somebody just lost the right. Somebody just we travel maybe 250 days out of 365, and uh, every weekend we've been in a new place for um, three months now. It gets pretty crazy, and you get really tired, and sometimes it like really takes a toll on your body and your mind. Somebody just died tonight. We don't have that nine to five job, and I've never had, and it's kind of weird to think about how everyone back home just kind of studying and working their way up to get that nine to five job, you know, and trying to um, go out there and do something that I guess everyone else is doing. I couldn't imagine doing something else actually. Like snowboard would be, or is my dream to do and continue doing. So I couldn't, I could never imagine doing anything else.